<laughs> what the hell? Content creator in this space, I will give, give advice to young up and comers. If you try to build a community on toxicity, on like takedowns and whatever, you will create a super toxic audience that isn't there for you. I hope he changes his ways, I guess, and is no longer uh, doing this kind of content because like it won't be sustainable in the long run. I mean, I, I guess he's right. I was really kind of mean in my video. You know, like these Twitch haters, they're not losers, not freaking losers. Um, so he's a cool guy. Like, I genuinely mean, he's a cool guy. And so he's right. You know what? From now on, I'm just going to stop making these videos. Like, I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm going to stop make, making fun of, like, people in general. Like, just... <laughs> Bro does not know how to box. What the hell? Bro, anytime I see like a big guy with all that size, like, and they don't know how to fight, I think myself like, what a waste of potential, bro. Like, what was it again? Um, Bradley Martin, he kept telling Devin Haney, what, the four-time world champion um, in boxing, that he could whoop his ass, which is wrong. Devin Haney would kill him. Like, any time you have such a like, any time I see a big guy talk about like, oh yeah I can beat him I can beat him but I'm just because of pure size that's not real bro. If anyone who knows how to fight and then they fight you, irregardless of size and they know how to manipulate your body and make you spasm, how do I say this or knock you out and disfigure you to the point where no one can really recognize you. They know like actual martial art techniques, you know anyone who knows that type of shit, like they will destroy anyone. Usually, it doesn't matter how big they are, usually, like, I'm usually in like 99% of the time, in a one-to-one -one fair fight. Like, what, anytime like Hassan, Hassan or thing, um, uh, Bradley Martin, instead of Bradley Martin going around saying, hey, oh, I, I, I can whoop you, I'll just grab you, and then something like that. But then, like, he tried to grab Ryan Garcia, and Ryan Garcia was already, like, or in the left hook. And I, I, I don't know what's going on here, like, it's just raw, a waste of raw potential. And I don't know what's going on here with fucking... <laughs> <laughs> fucking, this guy Steven Lin. Steven Lin's funny as fuck, I have to say. But yeah, it's it's, it's just weird to me. It's weird to me. Um, it, it does, it's also weird to me as well because I really like Sneeko. but Sneeko, bro, he wasn't he like he he wants to fight Daz Black. He wanted to fight Hassan. He wanted to fight these guys. But when one person wanted to fight him, like, I dubbed some shit. I don't know who wants to fight me. Ducked him. So what's going on here, Sneeko? That's not nice. That's not very sneak of you. I mean, it's very sneaking. Sneak. Uh, I'm gonna shut the fuck up now. What the hell, man? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god. I did not enjoy this video. L stream, L gamer, L streamer, L content creator, L everything. You should stop streaming now. Seriously. You should stop making content now. Seriously. I was just... What the fuck? Like, I don't know. I just OBS tunnel. Always literally, I was clicking my browser app and OBS tunnel. I was like, you know what? I might as well record a video. And. Motherfucker man, Steven Lin. That's crazy. Guys, hilarious. Seriously.